Actually, it was the first residency program in the country. Dr. Knight, who founded the hospital, started it over in the Lower East Side of Brownstone and realized that the people in training really should live within the hospital. Thus, the term residence was started. We really demand a whole lot more here. They have to be outstanding uh, researchers. They have to be leaders, whether starting out with just medical students, but ultimately as their chief residents, lead the whole team of medical students and junior residents as well. They have to be good at teaching. Their role as educators is equally important, and we teach them skills to become teachers and so that they really can shine as triple threats in academic orthopedics. So that's our goal, to train the next group of leaders who advance the field. In evaluating medical students for becoming a part of our residency, the number one factor is their uh, academic record and uh, their demonstration that they've had a track record of success. I want a resident who's hungry and who's going to come in here and take advantage of all we have to offer. Everyone who comes in here is exceedingly successful starting out, but I want them to have that fire in their belly, the grit, tenacity that they can go, wow, I'm a kid in a candy shop. The research here is going to be phenomenal. The clinical experience is going to be phenomenal. My ability to grow as an individual and as a leader is phenomenal and really live up past their potential. The HSS residency program has the most number of women and ethnically diverse residents in the country. We're very proud of that. We want a group of individuals who will become a true team. To do that, you have people with diverse backgrounds so that they can add a tremendous amount you're going to have a much richer environment. In addition, they go out to uh, underserved areas when they're in training and they get to learn about people who may not have access to care and that gives them a very rounded experience also. You can't become a physician and a surgeon without interacting with patients and so they have an opportunity to learn their surgical skills in the operating room under the appropriate supervisory roles, learn surgical judgment in the operating room, but also equally important in the clinic, learning how to interact with not only patients that do well, but some patients that don't do well. That's all of what you need to do as a physician. Her vitals were fine overnight. There's a lot of patients here. Not only is there a lot of them, there's a wide breadth of pathology that you see here. Just this morning, we rounded on somebody that had their hip replaced and they came in from Texas and they had a Perthes deformity from childhood and that's not that uncommon for HSS. It's critical that they are not only exposed to the garden variety orthopedic issues, but also more complex problems. At the junior level, the relatively straightforward stuff is really important for them to know the fundamentals, but also understanding that there are many ways to deal with more complex problems. I think what I've gotten is a good volume of cases, as well as a good foundation in basic concepts of orthopedics but also examples of how to apply those concepts uh, on cases that uh, aren't typically seen. That's been very valuable. As the number of surgeries have grown here, one of the things that we've had to really make sure that we kept our eye on is to ensure that the residents got the right number of cases and experiences with patients. It's not about residents providing care across all patients that come in. It's about selecting the best cases for them to learn on. So when they graduate, they have a very thorough uh, training. Certainly the residents are the core of our hospital. They take the majority of the care of our patients. They operate with us, and certainly all of us here who work at HSS are committed to resident education. I think if you want to become a true leader in orthopedics, this program is the best educational program in the country that will provide the building blocks for you to have that amazing career.